from Empey to King. We gotta make sure that this girl goes smoothly through the whoops and uh, with all eight or six inches of wheel travel. We're gonna see if we can find some of these boneheads or help me out around here. We know that guy right there. <laughs> Where's Jesus or George? Is he around? Oh, look at there's a stunt devil right there, huh? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think of the class 11? When's it gonna be done? Uh, I don't know. I need some shocks, baby. Yeah, I know we we had an order in for them. We're working on them. We got some custom shit going down. So uh, I don't know where they're at. They didn't expect me here, but we're gonna pop in and see what's up. See if we can find Brett, the man, the myth, the legend, and uh, see what's going down with these with these shocks while we're up in the area, and then go from there. Yeah, let's go find Brett and the engineer who was working on them. Oh, we got the engineers spot. working on this thing? Yeah. What? That's epic. I see some gear over there. I mean, they're finding Ramses and, and soup some of that stuff too. We just went to MP and got a huge, huge parts list there. This is you guys uh, got the motor all done or what? That's a whole nother animal that we're, we're working on. Class oh, 11 Brothers crazy. building that. But Dave McDowell's doing the transmission. And this is... Every time I come in here, it's like a kid in a candy store, bro. Crazy, right? Ah, uh, so epic. This is it, all in house. This is the real deal, baby. Some more of the other boys rolling through. What's up? Oh, so sick. You guys are getting a cheat today. You guys are seeing some major operations. Oh. Just the men we were looking for. Get those parts for that Ultra 4? Yes. Okay, how are you? What's up, dude? What's up, Jesus? Yeah, we got it. We got it uh, set it up right now. Mm -hmm. We're going to see if we can find out where yeah, these shots are at. It's cruising, dude. We're going class 11 racing. We're going to bang some shit, dude. There you go. Some kidneys, so. <laughs> yeah, I decided to pop in. I was at MP. Rough. It's just. Just don't go that now we're here. Just don't go fast. We'll see if we can find these things in a little bit. If you have ever been to King Shock, you know that this is a one-stop shop made here in the United States. Brett King, owner, operator, founder, badass shock guru, a man of many hats. Uh, we're here in the service department right now, um, where if you need to send your stock shocks in for a service, they got you. Customer service here is pretty awesome. I've never experienced anything like it. Um, even being a low man on the totem pole, uh, now we've worked closely with Brett to develop a class 11 specific shock to give us uh, give us the best of what we can make do with with the limited travel that we got. Uh, Brett also is a V-Dub enthusiast. He's got a V-Dub that he's been building for a while now that I would like to see come to fruition sooner than later. I know he's making some moves, but uh, we want to get together and shred. He's also excited to be a part of the uh, the trophy bug, um, we're, we're, we're still making moves in the right direction there, but I want to show you guys a little behind the scenes here at their facility. And uh, how many how many square feet you guys got here? This building right here is 55,000. 55,000. This is a Costco of shocks. It's a Costco of shocks, yes. <laughs> and they make everything for OEM vehicles to uh, high performance, top tier race truck stuff for like BJ Baldwin, Boss, just to name a few that that are no joke. The top tier, top tier athletes in the industry. Um, hopefully, we get to that level. But we're gonna go, we're gonna go to the bottom. We're going to class 11. And Brett, when I brought this idea to him, he's like, "You're a maniac," but I support it. So I know they got some custom drawings in the engineering department that we're gonna. We're gonna make do, but we're gonna find some front shocks here today. And uh, since I was in the area, I had to peek in and uh, light a fire under these guys' butts to where uh, I'm not scrounging last minute because uh, this is again a full custom application. So we'll try and find those and uh, do a quick little walkthrough and then uh, go wherever the wind takes us and hopefully get our hands dirty in the shop today because I'm doing nothing but run around. So yeah, let's check it out, Brett. Let's find these bad boys. Where where would we start to look? Uh, I need to do a little talking. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Uh, I need to talk to somebody. They got their personal stash somewhere. <laughs> Ooh, we're digging into the personal stash now. I like it. I like it. Now we're getting somewhere. Mm -hmm. Check these out. 
spin resis, two and a half inch resis, roughly 13 or 12 and three quarters inches long, six inch stroke. So we're playing by the rules here. Yeah, yeah. We're playing by the rules with a seven eighth shaft too. Five, five eighth bearing. Five eighth bearing, yeah. And then we have misalignments to obviously reduce that. I think Correct. it's to a 12 mil on the front. That's rad. These are beautiful. And then we got the rear custom bad boys right here. Check those out. So those are gonna utilize a 12 inch, seven eighth shaft uh, with a uh, side mount eyelet that'll still be within 18 inches between the pair to where we're still, we're still playing by the rules, but we're making custom shit. Yep. That's what's up. <laughs> in, the, in a little bit, so. All the uh, engineering, oh, we can't show you the valving, even though we're gonna have to be dialing that in. Um, we're here making this happen. These boys are on top of it. I'm super excited because we're coming swinging. A man here yeah. has a class 11 <laughs> himself. And uh, for the mint, there's some prize money. I guess a bunch of guys coming up from the south, supposedly. You gonna yeah, be there? Yeah, you playing your car again? Be well west, man. Oh, <laughs> this is exciting. Not gonna lie, kind of nervous because these guys have years and years of experience, and uh, we're gonna give it our best. And I'm gonna do my best to just finish. That's the goal, and uh, and and sh share this build with everyone and the story, and uh, work with some guys on, like King, for example, on. Uh, just making custom sick shit and I think some of the stuff will be available to the general public um, if if shit picks up so you can go mild or wild we're going wild but uh, you guys can, can build something like this on a much lower end for probably like six G's and come race with us so that's the goal is to get more people involved in this and come run with come run with all of us at, at these races big or small and yeah so this is the process behind it pretty sick to uh see the drawing see it all come together while i was in the area just want to stop by and hopefully next time i'm up here we're we're picking up these shocks and we're cycling and we'll uh, we'll share all that but king's on top of it if you know what's up you know what's up we're coming